Hey YouTubers, so today I'm gonna show you the steel target stand that I made for my mm, steel targets, AR500 and actually these are mild steel. So these are 6 inch targets and this is a 10 inch. Okay, so what I did was I bought one, one, two, three, four, five, five rebars and don't do anything on those two on these two you put two nipples yes they called they are called nipples and then for your main hanger elbow nipple uh, T connector T connector um, old hose for uh, serves as a spacer T connector spacer T connector, T connector, nipple and elbow. And this um, hangers, I bought this at also my local hardware for I don't know it's I think it's around five bucks and I cut them into three and then just bend it so that I can hang my targets with it. Okay, let's put it together. So the major requirement in making a target stand is it needs to be modular. You can break it down so as to fit any trunk, even if you have a uh, sedan. So this will fit a trunk of a car. Oops. Okay. Once you put the two legs, it is basically done. Okay, it's done. Now we can hang our steel targets. So you can either hang these small ones, one each. Or you can hang big gong so you can do with this kind of configuration 10 inch target This can also handle the heavier silhouette target, AR500 steel. <laughs> My son is playing. Let's hang it. Okay. So this will be extra. Okay. I can hold it. Cut, cut. Sa bahay. Kumi 
Bili ako ng angle grinder sa Option yan para pwede sa ibang targets. Yeah. Alright. Pero malaki okay. masyado yan eh. That's good. No. Ready? Or you can do this kind of configuration with six inch targets. We shot this today, it held up. Here, 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 but still works. Thanks for watching, guys.